Hey guys, this is Cliff Greeno with the Classic Auto Show, and tonight we're here at Bob's Big Boy in Northridge, California. And right now we are checking out one long 64 Pontiac Bonneville. And the owner is Scott. Hey Scott. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Good. All right, now this is a beauty. Oh, thank you. Give me the, give me the details. Well, it's a 64 <laughs> uh, Pontiac Bonneville, 389. Nice. Uh, my exactly. fuel injected. Uh, it's one owner car. Is it really? Yeah. Nice. I bought it from the original family. Wow. Pretty much everything that goes with it. Wow, that's fantastic. And now, has it been repainted or is that original paint? Um, the roof has been repainted. When I bought it, it had one of those big CB antennas in the middle of the roof. Oh my gosh, no way, really? <laughs> yeah, so I had to fill the hole. <laughs> and, uh, Wild. But other than that, it's pretty, the interior is all original. No way, really? Yeah, other oh. than the carpets. But the, the Does open. the dome light work? We can open the door and see? Sure. Oh yeah, that. Oh, look at that. I know it's uh, winter here in Southern California, but it's warm enough to go cruising. Oh yeah. It's only dark. That's the only problem. <laughs> uh, it's got look at pretty that. Pretty rare Classic. options. It's got tilt wheel. It's got. Um, nice. It's got air that was installed new, and in the back then, if you ordered air through the uh, factory, yeah. you lost all your gauges. No so kidding. the guys that wanted to keep their gauges ordered the uh, add-on air. Oh wow. Yeah. See the three gauges in the front. That became an air vent. So oh, that's where they did it. All yeah. right. And then the add-on would be the one down here. Yeah, which actually works better than the in-dash area. Did it really? Yeah. yeah way, way colder. That's awesome. It's got Cadillac six-way power seats, which is new. Wow. Back then, if you knew the order codes, you could order from different projects. Oh, that's wild. Yeah. I didn't know that. You said 389, right? 389. Wow. Yeah, let's check this baby out. I always love the nose on these, they're just so awesome. Nothing screams Pontiac more than that. Yeah. And actually, 64 had the deepest nose of any of the Pontiacs. Did it really? <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, oh, I was that's reading nice. an old salesman uh, video on YouTube. Really? And, it's, and it said the differences about the 64, and one of them is the deeper recessed grill. How cool. 17 body mounts, which. Wow. Yeah, which made. Replacing I know. the body mounts insane. Yeah, I can imagine. I got 14 on my 55 Chevy, and I, two of them I didn't, didn't even know about until yeah. I was trying to lift the body off. I'm like, hey, something's holding it. <laughs> exactly. And everything's new, all the suspension's new, so it really rides like a wide track body. Wow. That is sweet. At 80 miles an hour, it just, it just floats along, steady. right? Steady, yeah. Oh, that is awesome. You know what's cool too is that even in at night in the parking lot lights here, it's still picking up everything. It just looks stunning. Yeah, it's got it, when I bought it, it had fifty-five thousand miles on it. Now it's got seventy-eight. That's not bad. So it's not bad at all. It's gonna hit, it'll hit eighty this year. <laughs> yeah, cool, cool. What else have you done to it? Um, you know, it's a, it was a pretty straight car. I've just literally gone through and reconditioned everything. Like you said, suspension, right, stuff but, like that. But there yeah. were no, I didn't need any parts, no body parts, no nothing. Nice. It was, it's missing nothing. That's awesome. So, the, yeah, the only thing that's not stock on it is the, elect, the electronic fuel injection. Mm -hmm. And okay. I put air shocks in the back because even from the factory, the body was too heavy for the springs. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. How long have you had it? I've had it almost four years. Nice. And what brought you to the, this particular car? I saw a picture of it and I went, I gotta have it. I was I was actually I was looking for I know a, that feeling. I was looking for a Riviera <laughs> or a Grand Prix. And because you never see these. And I I'll be honest with you, I go to shows all the time. I've never seen another one. You, people, awesome. they threw these cars away. They took the engines out because they were yeah, drag right. racing engines. Yeah, of course. And they threw the bodies away. Oh my gosh. So I've seen one four door and a couple wagons, but you just don't see any coups. That is cool. You should definitely come down to the Classic Auto Show this year, March 2nd through 4th, 2018, at the I, Los Angeles Convention Center. I'll try to be there. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, you can check in with the Classic Auto Show, and uh, on their website, there will be entry forms that you can really try to get your car in. Yeah, cool. we'd love to have this down there, especially. Uh, you being... think this thing would qualify? Oh my gosh, yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Absolutely. This is beautiful. Well, Scott, thank you so much for showing us the car. You're welcome. And uh, we hope to see you down there at the show this year. I'll do my best. Thanks so much. All right, man. Have a good one. You too.